Well, as college campuses across the country grapple with reports of rising anti-Semitism and Islamophobia, Duke University is holding an event to face these issues head on. CBS 17's Amalia Roy tells us more about the event. The Duke community packed the J.B. Duke Hotel Ballroom on Monday to learn more about fighting hate and bias. The two-day conference has been in the works since the summer. But attendees say the rising tensions on college campuses makes it a timely topic. While the conference covers all forms of racism and bias, the main draw for today was a conversation with Jonathan Greenblatt, the head of the Anti-Defamation League. When you make hateful, when you hatefully harass your classmates, Greenblatt used part of his keynote address to speak about the state of anti-Semitism on college campuses across the country, but also stressed the importance of such events. Incredibly impressed by the leadership of Imam Abdullah and Tepli, who helped organize this conference. He's been a courageous leader speaking up for Muslim-Jewish dialogue for years. Many Duke students tell me that the campus has remained calm, but hope to use this conference to initiate more difficult political conversations. One, the one thing I'll say about being here at Duke because I don't think a lot of uh, conversation at all is being had um, about what's going on. People have come together in support of each other, but I don't think anyone's really asking the tough questions. The Combating Hate and Bias Conference runs through Tuesday and is open to the public. In Durham, Amalia Roy, CBS 17 News.